I'm Ben and you're currently watching Ben Mancha. Before we get into this video, I'm gonna show you a little preview of Thursday's video. So here is a video for Thursday. Let's open these up. Woo wee! Look at these bad boys right here, man. These are the real deal. Review coming Thursday. It's a different type of video, so stay tuned to the channel for that. So I can't wait for you guys to see that video Thursday. It's gonna be a review of the Jordan 1 Go Toe, but it's not like a normal review like everybody else does where they sit down and review the shoe. It's gonna be a vlog type of review. It's gonna be sick. I haven't seen anybody do this type of review on YouTube. I think I'll be the first one. I'm trying to be different this year. But let's get into today's video, which is what is the best shoe size to resell? This is a popular question for resellers and I have been ha getting this question a lot from people, you know, DMing me what shoe size is the best to resell. And the best shoe size is kind of tricky because different shoes have different sizes that are the most limited. What I would do is I would go with like everybody's size. Like most, the most common size is like 10 and 11. So those are the most common sizes that people will go after. So I think those would be the be your best bet to go after because everybody most people have a size 10 or 11 and that's going to be what people are going to be looking for online uh resell you can even go with size 13 and 14 because those aren't going to be as produced but i don't think there's a lot of people that have a size 13 or 14 shoe size that's why they're least produced so i bought some shoes out for reference for you guys so starting with these these are the lebron 10 uh, home elites and these resell for i think like 350 400 and this is the size 10 and this is the most expensive size on this shoe so you know it differs by sizes um and size 10 is the most expensive one if you ever want to see what sizes are more expensive definitely check out stock x i love shopping on stock x i just think it's a simple ecosystem simple app to maneuver around these are the lebron 15 kith um these resell for size 10 i think at 260 um and this is almost one of the least expensive sizes and for yeezys we have this is a size 10 and a half um this is actually one of the sizes that are, you know, a little up there in price. I think these are like $900 or $1,000. But for Yeezys, sizes to go for for Yeezys is like size 7 and 8. Because those are like, a lot of people have size 7 and 8 for women and kids and all that. So I would definitely recommend size 7 for that. Because size 7 is a little hard to come by. Uh, not a lot of made. But if you want to play it safe, I would definitely go with sizes that people normally wear like size 10 and 11 you can even throw in 9 so 9 10 and 11 that most people have those are the sizes that most people will be looking for and stuff so I would definitely recommend if you play it safe but if it's a limited shoe you know like the Yeezy I really don't care what size I get it would be nice to get your size of shoe because you can wear this and then sell it down the line you know I would definitely recommend always for reselling get your own size of shoe um, if you like it, you can keep it. And if you don't like it, you can sell it. That's what I recommend. Um, I'm definitely starting to resell. So that's one tip I would recommend for you guys. Just get your shoe size. Because if they don't resell for that much and you really like the shoe, then you can keep it. But if you don't, you're out money. So, But yeah, that's what I recommend. That's the biggest tip. I buy the shoe sizes that I wear. And if I don't like it, I'll sell it. And if I like it, I'm going to keep them in my collection. So I hope I helped you guys out. Let me know down below what shoe sizes you guys get to resell. And collection one is coming out pretty pretty soon i think in the next two or three weeks it will be i will be getting the shirt in and i will be selling it to you guys and it will be coming out collection one there's only one shirt made for collection one uh we were talking about it and collection one is gonna have one piece we might add some more we're talking about that so definitely stay tuned for that and stay tuned for the review on thursday of the jordan one gold toe we have a giveaway going on all you gotta do is subscribe to the channel Turn on post notifications, follow me on Instagram, badmatch underscore, and comment down on the giveaway video. Be giving away at 1,000 subscribers. And I hope you liked the video. And if you did, make sure to like, comment, and of course, subscribe. Until next time, peace.